Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome into For The Low. My name is Spencer and today I've got this really cool 301 disc CD player and changer made by Pioneer. The model number is PD-F1009. But before we get into it, did you know that the first ever available CD player commercially was the Sony CDP-101? Yeah, if you didn't know that, now you do. Let's go ahead and talk about this. So on the rear panel of it, you have your control input and output for connecting it to a system. And then you have your digital audio optical output, standard line audio output right there. And this was manufactured in August of the year 2005. To connect it, you'll just plug in your audio cable and then your power cord. And you can connect this to just about any speaker, but I would recommend using something similar to what you see here. And then once you have it all connected, you can go ahead and power it on and load up your discs. And you want to make sure that the disc label is facing to the right. Once you have them loaded, you can go ahead and select the disc that you want to play. And then you can push the button right there to Play the disc selected, and this is the original remote for it. And with the remote, you've got just about all the same features that you have on the front panel. You have your disc skip button, you can go up and down with the discs, you can use the number pad to quickly select a disc or a track, you can adjust how the display shows the time and the disc number. And then you have a best button. With the best button, you can, you can save up to a certain amount of tracks. I'm not sure what the amount is, but you can basically create a playlist of your favorite songs throughout the entire carousel. And by pushing best, it will play those songs. And then you have your highlight button. With the highlight button, it will scan through either a disc or all discs and what it does is if you just do the single disc scan it will scan through every single track and it will skip a minute into each track and it will play the first 10 seconds after the first minute and if you have it set to all discs it will do the same but it will only do it for the first track of each disc you do it so that you know what discs are where and then you have your previous button by pushing previous it will go through the previously played discs so that you know what was recently played if you heard a song you liked you can quickly go back to it and then with the repeat function you can set it to single track repeat or all track repeat you can do it so that you can play your music endlessly and then with program play you can queue up some songs with that button and then on the front panel here, you have your power button and then the mode button. With the mode button, you can set it to play all tracks, a single disc, or you can set it to a custom folder, which you can save certain discs onto that folder. And it will play only from that folder. And then you have the clear button, which is used for program play and then repeat again and then the display button and then you have your single disc loader options if you push access it will load up the single disc tray you can basically use this to use it as a single disc player if you wanted to and then you can push play with that and it will play that disc and then you have your number pad right here for selecting a disc or a track and then you have your open and close button. If you hold that while a disc is playing, it will open the front door so that you can load discs while continuing to play one. And then if you're playing a disc and you push the unload button, it will stop the disc and it will open the tray in that section. And then you have your play pause button, stop button, and then random button. With the, ran with the random button, it will randomly select a disc and then it will randomly select a track 
from that disc and it will play each track once and if you have it set to repeat it will play each track repeatedly so it will play your music non-stop if you have it on repeat and random and then right here you have your jog dial you can quickly go through the discs with that and then the enter button is right there and it's also got a CD text feature you can use that if if your disc has the name of the tracks saved onto it or the name of the disc saved onto it it will display it right here Pretty much all there is for this pioneer 301 disc CD player and changer it's pretty sweet Never touch a disc again by using one of these and prevent scratches from getting onto those discs. But if you want to order one, you can give us a call or check it out on our online store.